Hi, I'm Anna from Mini Orange. In today's video, we're going to see how to display Power BI reports in WordPress. We will see how we can configure row level security in Power BI. You can see these are the two reports, namely Report 1 and Report 2. First, log in to your WordPress admin account. In this business case, let's say you've analytics or report that you want to display to only specific WordPress users with certain memberships. We've already created the memberships in WordPress using the Paid Membership Pro plugin. First, log in to your WordPress admin account and go to the menu bar from the left-hand side and click on Memberships. For creating the memberships, you can also use any other third-party plugin like MemberPress, WP Members, and any other membership plugin. Now click on the View Membership Levels. As you can see on the screen, these are the memberships configured in Paid Membership Pro plugin namely Free, Premium, and Enterprise. Let's say these are the reports that we would like to display on the WordPress site for the users. Log in to your Power BI portal. Now enter the password. Assuming you have already established connections between Power BI and WordPress let's see how we can embed the reports. As you can see, this is where we have embedded shortcodes for both the reports that are Report 1 and Report 2. The first one corresponds to Report 1 and the second one corresponds to Report 2. We want to show reports according to the memberships configured in WordPress as something like Free Membership Level None of the reports are to be displayed Premium Membership Level Only Report 1 is to be displayed Enterprise Membership Level both Report 1 and Report 2 are to be displayed. The displaying of reports with respect to the membership levels would be configured by mapping in our Embed Power BI Reports plugin. Now, switch to the WordPress site. Click on the Membership Account drop-down list and select Membership Checkout. Let's start with creating a free account. Fill in the account information. And click on Submit and Confirm button you will see a membership confirmation message. Click on My Reports to see the embedded Power BI dashboard on this page. As you have a free account, you will not be able to see the report's contents. To access restricted data, you need to have a premium or enterprise membership account. Go back to the WordPress site to upgrade the current membership. Click on the Membership Account drop-down list and select Membership Checkout. Click on the Change option to change the membership level. Select for Premium level. Fill in your billing address and payment information. Click on Submit and Check Out. Click on My Reports. Now you will be able to see only the first report from the embedded dashboard view. To access both reports, we need to upgrade the membership level. Go to the WordPress site. Click on the Membership Account drop-down list and select Membership Checkout. Click on the Change option to change the membership level. Select for Enterprise Level. Fill in your billing address and payment information. Click on Submit and Checkout button. Click on My Reports. Now you will have full access to all reports. We can also configure the reports according to the WordPress roles, let me show you how this works. We want to show reports according to the configured in WordPress roles as something like Subscriber. None of the reports are to be displayed. Editor. Only Report 1 is to be displayed. Administrator. Both Report 1 and Report 2 are to be displayed. The displaying of reports with respect to the WordPress roles would be configured by mapping in our Embed Power BI Reports plugin. You can also configure reports according to roles as done for memberships, I will illustrate role configuration for you right away. So, similar to the embedding for shortcodes done in the membership case, we embed reports and show them according to the WordPress roles as I mentioned before. Here as you can see, I am creating sample WordPress users with different roles for testing the configurations we have mapped in the Embed Power BI Reports plugin. Now you can see users with different roles, User 1, Subscriber, User 2, Editor, User 3, Administrator. 
Let us see logging in using user1 credentials, then you won't be able to see any of the reports. If you log in into WordPress using user2 credentials which is of the editor role then you will be able to see the report 1 but not the report 2. Let us see the case when trying to log in via user3 and trying to access the page in which reports are embedded. You will be able to see all reports that are report 1 as well as report 2 as user3 as the administrator. In this manner, we saw how we can show reports from Power BI in WordPress according to the membership levels, WordPress roles using our Embed Power BI Reports plugin. If you have any further questions, please reach out to us at SAML support at securify.com, or you can leave us a message in the comment section below. We would be happy to help. Thank you for watching.